You know, I love to increase the chance of me catching more fish. Do you want to catch more fish? Let's talk about so lunar tables. Do you use them? You should. The so lunar theory is a hypothesis that fish and other animals move according to the location of the moon in comparison to their bodies. This theory was laid out in 1926 by John Knight, but it was said to be utilized by fishermen and hunters long before that theory was published. So lunar tables got their name from the soul representing the sun and the lunar representing the moon. John compiled information over many years and he looked at factors that impact the day-to-day -day behavior of freshwater and saltwater fish. 33 different factors were utilized in John's experiments and it turned out that the most important determinants were the sun, the moon, and the tide. The relationship between the moon and the sun's position to each other in conjunction with the tide movements make all the difference in the world. And the relationship to falling and rising tides made the biggest differences in feeding patterns. So lunar tables are tables that fishermen and hunters use to determine the best days of the month and the best days during the day to catch fish and hunt game. Knowing the time of the tides, the sunrise and sunset, and combining those things together is knowledge, and that'll help fishermen predict when the fish are going to bite. Stay curious, my friends. Check out this similar video. Our tips and techniques will make you a better outdoorsman. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already to keep more tips and tricks coming to outdoorsmen like you.